perfect. guys welcome back to the channel um, <clears throat> this is the second take on this video um, I'm a one-shot wonder um, I don't do a whole bunch of editing and stuff and we had some issues with the first one and I went ahead and rendered it down and uploaded it but I've I've decided just to delete that video and start completely over so here we are take two um, this is my model cars and coffee for the week um, as y'all know, I don't drink coffee, so that's what we're having this morning. Um, I don't even like the smell of coffee, so one of these energy drinks once a day, that's my, uh, my coffee in the mornings. Anyway, um, kind of a special build today. Um, there's really nothing special about the build, but it was the first video of model car content that I uploaded to my channel um, it was uploaded January 22nd of 2014 so that makes this build just a little over 10 years old um, that video is still on the channel so let's get her over here and get you a look at her that's her um, that is the monogram Bronco 4x4, uh, bullnose Bronco. Um, that was this kit right here. Um, same box art and everything, that exact kit. Um, and guys, I've, I've got a light rigged up here, um, because this thing is such a dark, teal green color that it just kind of looks like a green or a black blob um, sitting up here on the turntable I've got a photo booth on the way so hopefully we'll have some better videos for y'all um, this thing's pretty much out of box uh, we did black wash the grill um, turn signal amber under the turn signal lenses uh, the trim around the windshield is, I'm going to assume, probably um, testers, silver, hand brush, bottle paint. Um, wheels and tires are from the kit. Um, there is a black trim piece going down the side. I don't know if the camera is going to pick it up in the light or not. Um, once we get done spinning it around here we'll pick it up moving around so you can see the color um did the spare tire carrier on the back um this is painted in dupla color perfect match um spray paint um both the green and the white are dupla color uh, can't tell you how many times these mirrors have broke off of this thing and I've had to put them back on but uh for 10 years old I don't think we're doing too bad guys um, let's see take the top off the top's not pinned or anything it just sits on there um, interior is green um, if you guys know anything about these generation of um, Fords, they did some some kind of off the wall colors. Um, I had an '89 F one fifty that was white and it had like a midnight blue interior in it. And when I say blue, everything in it was blue. The dash, the seat, the carpet, the head, everything was blue. So we kind of did the same thing here with this green. Um, just picked out some stuff, you know, the console lid and some. Uh, stuff on the dash is black if you can get in there and see that um, like I said I'm, I'm working on a light box so we can maybe make some better videos oh uh, well we got it yeah there's the black stripe or the black body molding and you can kind of see the the color of this uh this teal green um, 
It's a real pretty color. I don't remember what brand, um, what automotive brand it was, whether that's a Ford color or Chevrolet or or what. Um, but I thought it was pretty. This hood's a little bit tricky sometimes to get up because it's actually still got the hinges on it. Um, this passenger side likes to stick. There we go. Um, just a basic little little 302 there. Um, nothing special. Picked out some, you know, like the washer bottle and stuff like that down in there. Uh, master cylinder. You know, no no wiring or anything done to it. Um, but yeah, like I said, this was the first model um, related video that I posted on my channel a little over 10 years ago now. Um, I guess you could say it was my one of my first adult builds um, because I would have been 29. So, uh, kind of, kind of in and out of the hobby, you know, from childhood to adulthood. But this is this is the first one that I slapped up on YouTube and and decided to start posting model builds. Um, but I won't hold you too long, guys. Um, hope you like it. Hope you enjoy it. Um, she's going back on the shelf over here. Um, just to be a little chef queen. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for tuning in. Um, I appreciate y'all more than you know. And like always, we'll catch you on the next one. See you guys.